All right, I'll play one more, but I'll try and ban, like, whatever needs banned. Try and claw out, but if it's, like I said, first game, if it's some giga dog shit, like, they just lock in the most elo inflated shit, like, perma win shit, because, because we missed a ban. I'm just going to go to my plat account for fun. Five hour streams again. It's miserable. These guys are so lost on the bounce. It's so crazy. If they just didn't touch anything, bro, I don't, I cannot comprehend why they do this, man. I, it, it, I don't know. I, I don't know. Nobody likes this shit. I don't know, bro. It's so crazy. It's every single game today, by the way. I said Aziri. Every single game, the Aziri's popped off. Bro, it's not even the same player. There is, it is just They are seriously stupid. Can't stand it, man. Yeah, I know I said it before where high elos, like, very, like, cringe where people only play the inflated shit, but I don't give a fuck. It, like, it's... It's, it's more so than ever, especially bot lane. Like, you have got to pick these disgusting supports. You have to pick these disgusting AD carries. Because they wanted to fuck with the items again. Why? No, dude. Wh why? Why did we change the items again? Does anybody... Can anybody tell me actually... Like, give me a non... Oh, so they have to... Give me a valid reason on why these guys changed the items again. Anybody. I Like, a, a serious answer, please. Like, I'm, I'm, I'm honestly trying to know why they did it. Shit is so fucking lame. Meta change? I would argue that meta didn't even change. Like, there's no meta change. Shit is garbage. Right, stop. Jinx and Aphilios and Pro. Okay, Aph Aphilios is 100% broken. Jinx, I think, did get weaker. People don't play her. All AD carries are crybabies. I don't think AD carry was... I don't think anybody was saying AD carry was weak, though. Like, the actual items. The problem with AD carry is you get a bad support or if you get a bad jungle, so you get camp. But it's not like the AD carry items were the problem. It was not an 80 carry item problem. That's why I'm completely at a loss why they did this shit. And they would just want people to have a lot of options with different build paths. Bro, unfortunately, that's not what League is nowadays. And people will find the same exact build path and build it every game. If, if it's for build diversity, there is no build diversity. Nobody's building this. It's the same shit as before. I would argue just to get rid of items in general, to be honest. But it is the same exact shit. And even, it's even more so now... Items matter infinitely more than champions. Infinitely. Items are the most important thing in League of Legends. People who play champions because they abuse items well, not because they have the, the items make the champions good. Like, for, for instance, Ziri. Ziri is an item abuser. She abuses items. It's garbage, man. If you get a game where the enemy team's not just fucking shamelessly locking it in, or your team's not just locking in shame, where people actually play the game to have fun, like me on a Lowey, for instance. It's so much better. But the strong shit is so unbearable. You cannot deal with the strong shit. Remember the mythic items? It's not even mythic. The mythic. So, which was better? Shield bow, gale force, kraken being mythics? Or whatever the fuck we have now. 100% shield bow, kraken, gale force was better than whatever the fuck we're playing with now. 100%. Easily. It, it's not even comparable. No mythics at all? Okay, yeah, well, okay, but I'm arguing about the no mythic items versus, I'm, I, I'm, uh, yes, so no mythics was better. I completely agree, you're right. But out of the two fucked up systems, which fucked up system was better? Shield bow, gale force, kraken. Not close. And how could you ever even argue? You'd have to be a dumbass to even try and argue. And I'm sure Riot will be like, they'll pull out their fucking little notepad, they'll pull out their statistics, and they'll give us a bunch of bullshit data. Well, actually, 57% of players that build stat 74% that build this out of the, every third game equals they're having more fun. Like, play the game, bro. Play the game. Just play the game one fucking time. See how bad you've made it. Shit's crazy. Oh, yeah, the old one. But I'm glad this one is going horrible because in the article, they said that was their last attempt to fix it. Otherwise, you're going to remove Mythic. So I'm glad the game's on fire. Do you know how long that means, by the way, bro? When they said they're, when they say they're gonna remove it if it doesn't go well, it's not like oh it'll be done in a, two months, a month. It won't even be preseason. It'll be next next year midseason patch if they admit it's not a failure. But by the time it's midseason patch, the items will finally be balanced and the game will be playable. And then guess what they'll do? Right in the middle of the season. They'll fucking chuck it out the window and fuck everything up again. Because it's what they do every midseason. Every mid every single midseason. There's not one. It is fucking midseason every time. I don't know why they still do it. You are not retaining players. Drop the concurrent viewer account. Excuse me, the concurrent player account. 
prove me wrong. You are not Fortnite. When you ch people do not people quit before they keep playing when new league when new shit is added to league, man. Ninety percent of the time, one hundred percent. I have never heard anybody be like, "Yo, ban Ziri, you freaks." I've never seen out of my thousand million hours of playing this game anybody be like, "Oh yeah, I came back because the new items." Nobody says that, bro. If they do, they're one and done. They're gone after a week. They are gone after a week. It doesn't make sense. <sighs> Should I main trigger trying to find a champion in the general? We're able to get a Play Graves. Play Zin. How can you possibly know that though? It's, dude, it's just like, because it's just like business. It's just business, is what it is. It's just simple. It's business. Especially in League of Legends. It is like, just think, think about how hard, how fucking many hours you have to play this game. Whether you, you're a noob or you're a good player, how many hours you have to play to learn League of Legends. To learn the 180 fucking champions matchup versus how the other 180 champs to build what items, when to build what items, how to trade level one, two, three, where to path, where to stand, where to start. You have all this shit that you take years learning, and then they're changing it every four months. There's no, it's it doesn't make sense. A new a normie player, a casual player, they're not playing, man. Nobody's playing through this shit. That's why I am 100% convinced. Aram carries the good legends. Actually, Aram carries league. I think more people, like a significant amount of Aram normie players, play than play ranked. So balance doesn't actually matter for the success of league, as as long as they're playing casually. Not just Aram, but like special game mode, customs, normals. Not all other players just play TFT now. Yeah. So that's so that the whole that whole thing is why I think they, honest to God, probably don't even give a fuck about rank. For the balance, which uh, whatever, but it's fucking the items because items affect ARAM. But are ARAM players actually do they actually care? No, bro, they don't actually care. Normal game players, maybe they care. Games with friends, maybe they care. But it's pretty much the uh, the item change, especially in the middle of the season, only really affects ranked players. And we all know Riot does not give a fuck about rank. They do not give a fuck about the ranked quality. So if by just the boosters, shared accounts, win traders, betters. Account sharing, all the bot problems in low elo, right? Very clearly does not care about ranked solo queue on any region. So if you don't fucking care about it, then fuck the balance. Which I believe is what, what they're doing. I'll play, give me playing like Nicky Patch. Thanks, bro. I'm sorry, dude. Sorry, King. Or I haven't heard of Diamonds, so my opinion means shit, but they don't give a fuck about boost accounts and Diamond or Griefers. Nah, not at all. That's been years.